Welcome back to EDU Kid Space's theme week on fungus. This is From Spore to Mushroom by Lisa Owings. Note to parents, educators, and readers. Some species of wild mushrooms are extremely poisonous. Mushrooms growing in the wild should not be consumed except by knowledgeable mushroom hunters. Look at these mushrooms. How do they grow? First, a mushroom releases its spores. A mushroom spreads its cap. This part of the mushroom looks like an umbrella. Underneath it are soft parts called gills. Between the gills lie millions of spores. They wait to be released. They drift away on the wind. The spores land and start to grow. The spores are like seeds. Some land where mushrooms can easily grow. These spores sprout hyphae. These are a little like roots. Then, they seek a mate. The hyphae snake through the soil. Two hyphae from different spores cross paths and join. When this happens, they can make a mushroom. The fungus grows roots. More hyphae shoot out to support the fungus. The hyphae form a part called the mycelium. It gathers nutrients the fungus needs to grow. Next, a mushroom bud forms. The fungus waits until conditions are right. Then it get, gets ready to send up its fruit. The mycelium forms a small bud at the surface of the soil. This will become the new mushroom. Soon, a baby mushroom appears. The mushroom bud grows into a small egg-like ball. It is protected by a soft outer shell called a veil. The shell contains a tiny mushroom. The mushroom breaks through its shell. The rounded cap of the mushroom breaks through the veil. Pieces of the torn veil can often be seen on the growing mushroom. The mushroom fruit takes shape. The mushroom grows larger and its tightly closed cap reaches outward. Different types of mushrooms develop in different ways. Each has its own unique shape. The new mushroom continues the cycle. The new mushroom is fully grown. It releases its spores on the wind. It provides meals for hungry bugs and animals, even humans. Then it decays and new mushrooms sprout in its place. Glossary. Decays means slowly breaks down. Fungus. A living thing that often looks like a plant, but has no flowers and that lives on dead or decaying things. A mushroom is a fungus. Hyphae. The root-like threads that make up the mycelium of the fungus. Mate. One of a pair of hyphae. Mated hyphae can make a new mushroom. Mycelium the network of hyphae that's, that forms beneath mushrooms and gathers nutrients. Nutrients, substances that plants, animals, and people need to live and grow. Spores, cells made by mushrooms and some other plants. <laughs> I guess I should say mushrooms and some plants since mushrooms aren't plants, but spores are like seeds and can grow new mushrooms. Veil, a covering. That was From Spore to Mushroom by Lisa Owings. And this is EDU Kidspace. Subscribe for more stories, books, and lessons. And if there's something in particular you'd like to learn about, maybe you could suggest another theme week, leave us a message in the comments or send us a message. You can buy this book to support the authors and this channel. And find more cool mushroom resources in the video description.